Hey, what's going on YouTube? How you guys doing today? Um, yesterday, obviously, went to the $1 yard sale with uh, Treasure Hunting with Jeebus. You know, Steve and Amber did really good. As always, we love their yard sales. I thank you very much. You always give a great deal and you look out for us. But I just wanted to give you all a little quick peek as to what we got from there. Um, I think we did really good, but I'm gonna show you all and let me know what you think. So it came through and we got this really nice cooler here. The skill drill. Uh, we got some brand new letters for putting your lettering on your boat. Couple Ryobi cases. Some tent stakes with some corkscrew anchors. Uh, we got these car ramps over here. Let me see. I can't really see them too well. But we did get them. I'm sorry to the person that I grabbed them out in front of. Uh, I tried giving them back to you. I'm sorry. But much appreciated. We got the D Walt. Uh, tea stack box. It's just an empty shell to hold your tools and everything goes in a system on a little hand cart. That's nice. I will keep that because it will go with my set. But just some couple little basic tools. Nothing special, but I mean these wrenches Alana found and I mean look at the look at the size of this thing. Like those are some serious wrenches. So much appreciated. Um I mean, even stuff down to this, you know, box of three inch exterior deck screws, brand new, never opened. That's $10, you know. Um, get this nice little Craftsman air pump roadside, plug it in your cigarette lighter and pump your tires, turn your lights, or has lights and strobe and all that good stuff. Really nice. We got the Bissell. Uh, carpet cleaner unfortunately it's missing a piece I didn't really notice that um, so that, that's kind of a bummer maybe I can sell it off to someone for parts or maybe I'll find something somewhere someday it was really nice though but I guess that's what you get for not looking very thorough little Bissell vacuum I got a toolbox here now. <laughs> Look, this is all full of band-aids. Entire thing, well, band-aids and trail mix. So, a nice toolbox. Uh, so, that, that's a cool find. We got a dog food container, which is nice because we do have a cat that likes to self-indulge. And... Let's just say his belly is like a built-in Swiffer sweeper. So this way, we can put his cat food in there. We got a Kong treat ball for the dog. You know, put some peanut butter and then do will work for it. A couple baseball cards, nothing, nothing special. Let me sit them over here out of the sun. Uh, a couple nice little lamps. These are old vintage kerosene style lamps, oil lamps. Little coral desktop thing. Um, we live near the beach, so people will get that. Check out these little things. I don't know if you can see them very good. <sighs> Probably not, but a couple little cat crystal. Uh, a shocking thing for like muscle stimulator. We got a nice little glove with a couple softballs. My sister's husband has some girls that are into softball, so that'll probably go to them. Really nice set of golf clubs and a nice bag. All these goodies were inside of it. You know, we got some golf balls, some tees, some gloves. Not bad at all. Pretty nice. And Alana found a second set not quite as nice as the first set but let me show you guys something i don't know if you can see it so where we live we 
have a golf course right across the street. Now you're probably not going to be able to see it, but right across the street there is a golf course. Right over top there, you can almost see the peak of the clubhouse roof. So that's nice. Those will sell around here. Uh, so grab them just just because. Now we got this nice cooler here. Once again, we're we're by the beach, so everyone likes their coolers. Uh, they will sell. So we got these couple dragon tail characters, which I feel as though I saw them in the video when Jeebus and Amber found them. Uh, get a little SpongeBob, you know, he'll sell. I, I don't know where this dog came from, but look at all these beanies. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen tie beanie babies. So that's that's good. I mean, they'll, they will sell. Uh, you know Alana, she's big into her Poshmark. So, she found a bunch of cool purses. I mean, this little Superman drawstring backpack with the cape, that's pretty neat. But, like this purse here, I mean, there's there's some some good things hiding there. This is uh, an NYC. Um... I don't know what that one is. I believe this one was the coach. I'm almost certain. Yep, a coach, coach purse. This was Relic wallet. Pretty nice little wallet. Mark Fisher. Um, very, uh, that's a 31 bag. Uh, I don't know what this is, but it's got Estee Lauder. Okay. This was a decent heavy purse when I pulled it out. Um, what's this bag? It's dirty, but she washes everything. Like, it, if we get clothes or anything, it all gets washed. Like, she will not put anything out for sale unless it has been washed. And if it can't get washed, then it gets thrown away. Fossil. Uh, I don't know what that is. Meech Claire, who knows? Liz Claiborne, but overall, some good, good purses. Uh, not bad. So, thank you. We got some Pumas, some Nike slides, some Fila work boots. Uh, we got a couple other belts, but the one I, I thought was cool. Let's check this out. It's a Mustang, and it's a seat buckle. So it's a seatbelt belt. <laughs> I thought that was neat. Uh, we got some military fatigues. Thank you for your service, whoever's uniform that was. They will sell. Uh, we got some old books. She told me to be careful with them. A lot of Disney books. Looks like Pooh and just a bunch of random books. I'm not going to dig too deep into those. But she did, look at these, look at what we found. All right, so we got some Nike jerseys. This one is Mims. And these are the Jets, obviously, sorry guys. And then this is a Adams, but look, the Adams has brand new tags, $100 price tag. So I grabbed a couple jerseys the other day these are gonna go with those jerseys. We're, we're, uh, I like to sell jerseys local. I mean, people that want jerseys, they wanna see them, feel them, touch them, make sure they're good. Let's see. We got a bunch of nice little clothes. Um, like there's Puma, Puma with tags on it. You see that? I mean, $60 tag. Um, Calvin Klein. And she was happy, Express. She was happy when she found these because these are actually nice, clean clothes. 
where we don't have to spend the time, another express, to actually wash everything. I mean, these things are like ironed, hanging on the hangers, like really nice clothing. Some, some slacks, some, some pants here. Uh, Murano, and I don't know. They're white, so I'm not gonna touch, touch them a whole lot. Uh, we did get some brand new gloves, some jersey gloves, brand new. It looks like two pairs, two pairs in a pack. We'll take it. But overall, I mean, Log, uh, Express, Murano, like some pretty, pretty nice clothing. We got a Nike zip up hoodie, a banana costume. I don't know. I don't know how that got in there, but she liked it, so it's there, guys. Um, Martins. I don't know what that is. OP? Is that Ocean Pacific? I, I, I don't know, guys. Uh, the jeans. Jeans sell, you know. Some Wranglers. Apple and Brooks, Appel and Brooks, I don't know, Appel and Brooks, Appel and Brooks, okay, so Jeebus, did y'all get like a superior uniform group, did you get a, a, a suit, like a suit rental place, I did notice, yeah, there's another one, I did notice y'all had a lot of nice suit jackets and stuff there, um, uh, so that was kind of cool. Rustler, some Levi's. So we'll set those guys to the side. And then she got this 31 hanging bag. Hang it on the door and it's got a bunch of cool little storage in it. But she may keep that one, honestly. I don't know. Let's see what she wants to do. A couple little shirts, like there's a Harley shirt. There's a Rusty Wallace shirt, and just like a Ghost Rider motorcycle shirt, just a couple kids shirts. Uh, but then you get into fancy, shiny, sparkly dresses. I'm trying to find the good stuff for you guys. Uh, Parish Nation, military coat. I mean, there were some, some good things hiding down here in this pile. Uh, and some of them are mystery clothes because honestly, Bobby Brooks, uh, like that cooler there was full of clothes. I didn't even know what was in it. I flipped the lid, saw clothes, and I really wanted a cooler, so I just took the whole cooler. <laughs> uh, what else was it? There was another surprise somewhere. <sighs> that printer box. That was one of the first things that Alana grabbed. And after we got it, paid for everything, it's like, so there's the printer in there. She opens it up, and there's clothes. But, look, we love clothes. Clothes do sell. Um, so not, not complaining, not one bit. Thank you for everything. A uh, little polo shirt. So let's check this jacket out. This is a sheepskin jacket. No. No, this is the leather jacket. Nice leather jacket. Murano. Ralph Lauren, Tommy Hilfiger, DKNY, Perry Ellis. I mean, nice dressed up H&M, H&M. Here it is, right here. So this is a sheepskin jacket or lambskin or something. Uh, pretty sure, yes, genuine lambskin. So she, she saw that and figured that was good. So she kept it. There's some Puma pants. Calvin Klein. And some more pants. Come over here. We got some solar lights. I mean, they're like brand new. Check out this fan that I found. That's really cool looking. Pretty neat. Uh, this is like a, a sun hat or something. 
pretty cool little sun hat. We got this iced tea infusion jug I thought was pretty cool. I opened it up. And it's still brand new in the plastic. So, uh, Connie, if you're watching this, we learned something about tea. Thank you for your knowledge. We'll use it in the future. Uh, brand new shaker bottle, you know, from GNC. That's, that's pretty cool. Got this Lasco tabletop heater that rotates. That's really neat. Uh, let's see. You got a CO2 tank for paintballs. A couple new picture frames. I did score this Lion King DVD Blu-ray combo. Uh, brand new pumpkin carving kit. If you all know, we got three boys, so we will be using that in the fall. This thing here, I did not know what it was, but my wife showed me. This is a hole punch, a really old hole punch. And it's metal, so we're going to look that up. Got a little K cup, you put your own coffee into it. Uh, these are cool, believe it or not, I picked these out. <laughs> <laughs> but these are snow snowman music like musical boxes and there's a santa musical box over there nice nice quality items i'm not going to crank them because you know how youtube goes with that it's a nice little candle set I found some bells I don't, I don't know this little snow globe put some batteries in it and because it moves it all around. Pretty cool. Um, we're keeping the Christmas theme. Brand new thing of boxes, gift boxes, 10 gift boxes. Uh, this was cool. Let me make sure we're still recording. Yep. Check it out. We got a, a My Passport with the cord. So nice little external hard drive. That's neat. That's a good find. We get some little Vivitar speakers. I believe this is a Xbox battery for the controller. We're going to find out. Lord knows my kids go through batteries. Uh, brand new Realtree wallet. We got a fiber optic audio cord. Check these out. So I looked at these trimmers. Can you all see that? $98.99. And they are in this box. That brand in that box. That was pretty cool. We got a hair dryer, a flat iron, some straight blades for this old razor that we found in another unit. We actually found it with this clipper, so that's kind of cool. You find something in one unit and then you find something somewhere else that goes with it. So that's neat. Get this nice Sony stereo. Uh, it is older. But you can tell it's, it's good. It's got the five disc CD changer, the tape decks, you know, nice little speakers. Not sure what it's worth, but I got a feeling we'll be able to sell it pretty easily. Um, got nice suitcases here, matching set. We got some Christmas stuff, some pot holders. And, uh, these were actually, I believe she said these were, well, that's a Hallmark bear. What are these? I don't know what those are. Little Christmas bears. Um, what's in here? Nothing. Nice little box. So she did find this ink pen. Old fancy ink pen got roses it's a sandra sandra mullins i don't know if that's the person who owned it or wait what's on here uh i don't know it's cowhide it's the best i can tell you so check this out all right so one says salt shakers Salt and pepper shakers are collectible. So we got some turkeys and we got some squirrels. But Alana's been, oh look, a nice little uh, bandage. Uh, she did find this like water bag or something. I think she said it was a cool pack. Um, Alana's big into her Pyrex lately. 
So we got one Pyrex, two, three, four Pyrex. I believe even these, yeah, the white Pyrex. So there's a whole lot of different type of Pyrexes. I believe even this thing was Pyrex. I'm scared to touch it because if I break it, she's gonna kick my butt. And then this guy I found, uh, and it's Ivory Bone China Bowl. So that's pretty cool. But in general, that's what we got. Uh, we did really good. Amber gave us a really good price. So that's what we got, guys. Um, once again, thank you, Amber and Stevie. Um, had lots of fun. I always enjoy it. The drive, meh, a little further, but it's worth the drive. So I'm not going to complain one bit. Um, thank you. Hopefully you see this and you see the gratitude. Um, but that is for right now, I'm going to get all this packed up and back in the garage. Uh, I'm going to do something and it might scare you guys. So don't, don't freak out. All right, here we go. Look, this is the life of people who buy storage units. So, so I mean, there's there's my garage, you know. Scary, right? Just scary. I'm not going to show you inside because that's where most of the sorting goes. But then even over there, I got the sheds. <laughs> and they, they're full. Uh, we're going to have our own yard sale this Saturday coming up, which I believe is the 30th. So, if you are in the Seaford, Delaware area, come check us out. Um, but as always, if you like it, like, comment, subscribe, follow us on our eBay, on our Poshmark, check us out. Let us know if we did good. Let us know if we did bad, but we'll see you on the next one.